You want another one or is it too soon? Oh, how about you, huh? Hmm. Yeah, you reluctantly ate that one, huh? Huh? You reluctantly ate that one. These are rat pink forelimbs, which work really well. It's like, uh, you know, if you got a turkey drumstick, you know, and ate the whole thing yourself, you know, one piece. Oops, sorry folks. Gotta get the little piece of debris off. And, come on. Come on. Have another. Come on. Oh, I'm sorry folks. Oh! <laughs> well, he took the whole thing right off the end of the tongue. He's got the idea. Holy cow. He's a good guy. Alright, now let's uh, concentrate on this other guy. Yeah. These, of course, are the baby squamagers that were born at my place a few weeks ago. Come on, bud. Come on. There we go. Now, the idea is just to leave it hanging in their mouth and sometimes they'll spit it out and sometimes they'll woof it down after a minute or so so uh, he ate the first one so he'll probably take the second one hi how are you are you was that tasty i'm talking to the other guy There we go. There we go. That's very good. That's two for you and three for you. Alright. Uh, yes, it's rat pink mutilation night here at the lair. Okay, let's see if the second one will do this like the first one did. No, it doesn't look that way. Come on. The first one, the other one, just grabbed it and sucked the thing down like it was Linda Lovelace in Deep Throat. Ooh. Hey, stop that. Come on. Come on. Come on. Eat it. Come on. Come on, I got other snakes to feed. There you go. Good for you. you. You didn't spit it up. You kept it down. These guys are getting a little on the thin side. So I was hoping uh, I give them some beef heart here because pinky heads are, are nice, but they're not uh, all that nutritious overall. Alright, I'm going to have to stuff you. Come on, you can do it all by yourself. Come on. Okay, okay. Ooh, you're big and mean. And uh, you're frightening me. There you go. Come on. Do it all on your own. That way I don't have to molest you. Come on. Come on, be a good snake. There you go. That's a good boy. Come on. Come on. See, folks, that's why I use beef heart because it's the right shape for them to suck it down if they're so uh, interested. Good for you. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna feed you guys beef heart uh, until you're able to do whole pinkies like that because the beef heart was easy and simple. Come on. 
Come on, swallow it. Come on. Everybody got some water tonight. Tonight's an off-feed night. Therefore, uh, only troublesome uh, guys get fed. And uh, everybody else gets water. The Viper Amidite shed out. Uh, I've got some other guys in shed. Come on. Come on. Suck that down. Come on. Come on. You got to go and get it the rest of the way. Come on. I don't have all night for this. Come on. Come on. You're doing good. Come on. Get it the rest of the way. Come on. Now, suck this down. Go on. Come on. Come on. Yes, folks, you don't see me doing this. Come on. Come on. Sometimes if you bother them, they'll either go two ways. They'll spit it out, or they'll take it the rest of the way down. Now, he's going to eject it, so I don't have time for this, so I'm just going to going to expedite things. There you go. Beef heart goes down so easy with minimal struggle. Safety for the animal. Safety for me. Good nutrition. Well, that's if they stay straight. Come on. No fuss, no muss. There you go. Good meal in a package. Come on. Come on. Let's take it the rest of the way. I know you want to bite me. I know you're coming close. No reason to panic, though. Uh, look at that. See that little little sticker right there, right next to my thumb? That wants me very bad. There we go. Okay. Next victims coming right up. Okay, now let's see if these little guys... We'll suck down a piece of beef heart. Mm. Yeah, it's mouse flavored beef heart. Come on. Mm. There you go. No, you're going to be a pig head too, huh? <clears throat> I'll take the beef heart salami. And make it disappear. Yeah, what's this in my mouth? I just woke up from this dream and this was here. Let me see if I can do a little zoom. So you can see the little beastie. We scented this one with a little bit of mouse brain. Come on. Come on. Come on. I think this is a little boy, therefore, it's one of those difficult feeders. I did say we were up here on difficult feeder night. Come on. Come on. Looks like I'm going to have to stuff your butt too. Well, okay. Stuff your yap. We don't do butt stuff in here. Come on. Come on. Okay. Watch out for the death roll. There we go. I knew I could convince you to eat it. There we go. Get your tail out of your mouth. Whoa! See, sometimes these little things that get in the way actually cause big, huge problems. 
trying to move that little tail out of the way and nearly got me chomped. Oh, and you decided not to eat that. Our first uh, eyelash viper victim uh, decided not to eat either. No matter. I'll stuff it too. Stuff it. Okay. Okay, he may actually eat the beef salami there with mouse brain coating. So we'll just let him uh, decide if he's going to do that or he's going to require further intervention. I'd much rather do this in steps like a cyst feed, stick it in her mouth, see if they'll take it the rest of the way down themselves, or if not, well then I'll stuff them. It's entirely up to them. I would prefer not to stuff them, but uh, after uh, all is said and done, uh, they're going to eat. Okay, bud. Come on. Man, I'm really sorry I missed that first guy because uh, he just <laughs> uh, just made that thing disappear like uh, you're putting it in your pocket. Jake, stand still. Be quiet. No knuckle cracking. Okay, I am so happy you decided to see it my way. It makes it so much easier on us both. Woohoo! That was very nice. Now I'll just pick you up by your little uh, handle here, put you back in there, and send you back down below. Now, this guy still has a lump from an earlier meal, so I'm not going to even bother with uh, that one. I will. I will try and see if it wants to eat on its own, but I'm certainly not going to molest it. Uh, and feed it, force feed it. You know, it still has uh, undigested uh, mouselet in there. 
Hmm? You want that? Hmm? Ah, okay. See, if they do it themselves, then I don't have to do anything else. And that's what I like best. Woohoo! Now you guys, Mr. Mr. Brown Man, woohoo! He's getting big. Okay, well, we'll just uh, put this guy away and let him or her uh, enjoy. Okay, now here's a little tricky customer. Force feeding them is uh, always an interesting thing. As you can see, these are wee little snakes. The guy, these guys, you know, will eat a, a mouse, but uh, I don't think they're quite warm enough to do that. They should be at least probably 10 or 15 degrees hotter than I have them. But right now, uh, it's not summer in their little desert. Come on, bud. With little heads like this, this is very, very difficult. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Come on. These guys will death roll their heads right off. We have to work on a, a smaller tool level here. Come on. Come on. There you go. Come on. Oh! Alright, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to get this all the way down, this little guy. Ooh, we're mad now. We're mad now. Look, no biting the handler. I know, I'm very sorry. No biting yourself either. I gotta go back to the big blunts because otherwise I'll twist a little. Hey, 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 that's not. I can see you're very upset. Come on. I know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nothing like a little very upset viper. Yeah. All right. There you go. Bite. Bite. Because if you take it, I'll let you have it. Come on. He wants to let me have it. Come on. Come on. Okay, up. Oh. He ejected it. Okay, okay. We we have no time for this craziness. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, this is one of these days. These guys are gonna get me. Okay, I can't do this on camera, folks. That's exceedingly difficult, but I did get it in its mouth. As you can see, it's got lots of skin folds. That's a very bad sign. Uh, sometimes when you see skin folds, more often than not, it's too late. That the stress will put the animal over the edge. We'll see if it uh, ingests uh, the piece all on its own. Let me put it in the dark. 